Reuters, record-shattering Arctic cold reached as far south as Florida on Monday with freeze warnings in place from Texas to the Atlantic coast and the northeastern United States facing another cold wave at the end of the week, forecasters said. Temperatures were from 20 to 30 degrees Fahrenheit, 11 to 17 degrees Celsius, below normal across the United States east of the Rocky Mountains, with only southern Florida untouched by the Arctic blast. A euro or at that degree of cold will be with us until tomorrow a euro said Brian Hurley, a National Weather Service meteorologist at College Park, Maryland. A euro at US day morning, we euro trademark re-looking at temperatures with very high probability of record lows a euro. Along Alabama euro trademark s Gulf Coast, the temperature in the city of Mobile could hit a low of 16F, minus 9C, overnight. Stiff breezes were expected to create dangerously cold wind chills across southeastern Georgia and most of northeastern Florida, the weather service said. A euro or everybody a euro trademark s bundling up right now a euro said Ray, an employee at Lovia euro trademark s travel stop in Loxley, Alabama, who declined to give his last name. He said the winter temperatures were not unusual but the truck stop had prepared for the cold by putting additive in fuel to guarantee it would flow freely. The mass of frigid air pumped south by a dip in the jet stream sent temperatures plunging across the U.S. heartland. Omaha posted a low of minus 20F, minus 29C, breaking a 130-year-old record, and Aberdeen, South Dakota, shattered a record set in 1919 with a temperature of minus 32F. Minus 36C. The cold will be unrelenting across the Middle Atlantic and northeastern United States, with up to two dozen low temperature records expected in those regions over the next day or two, Hurley said. Although the cold should ease across most of the United States after Tuesday, the northeastern quarter of the country will see a repeat of the current frigid temperatures from Thursday to Friday as another Arctic blast hits the area. The private AQ weather forecaster said the cold snap could combine with a storm brewing off the Bahamas to bring snow and high winds to much of the eastern seaboard as it heads north on Wednesday and Thursday. The only part of the United States spared the deep freeze is the southwest, with above normal temperatures and dry weather expected to continue there, the weather service said.